I have got my rather large Primark bag down here and I am very excited. So the first thing that I got, I actually made a pact not to buy any more of these because I already have a massive collection and I just need to stop. Um, this is a pillow and this is Mr. Raccoon. Say hello, Mr. Raccoon. Wait, you can't, you're a cushion. I fell in love with him and look at his little nose. I love him so much. And it's also reversible, so you've got two raccoons for the price of one. This pillow cost me five pounds and I just thought he was so super cute that I couldn't just leave him on the shelf. So yeah, this is my first thing that I got and I love it very much. Next, I have a t-shirt. Now, I actually bought this for Halloween because I have a few Halloween makeup tutorials coming, so that's exciting. Um, this cost me five pounds and I only realized today that it glows in the dark, which I just think is super, super cool. So yeah, it's very spoopy and I love it. Next is also another t-shirt and this one is white and on the front it just says no drama because it ain't about that drama life, you feel? Um, I also really like white t-shirts. So yeah, there's a t-shirt for my collection and this only cost me three pounds. Three pounds, that's ridiculous. Moving swiftly on, now I'm not gonna lie, I got prematurely excited for Christmas when I went to Primark this time around, and they had these. Now I'm pretty sure they had these last year, but they didn't have my size because they sold out, so I got some early this year and I'm really happy. These are Mr. and Mrs. Gingerbread Man or Lady um, leggings, and they are so, so thick. They cost 10 pounds, which is kind of steep for a pair of leggings, but they're thick, they're cuddly, and they're gonna keep me warm. So I'm gonna save these for Christmas, and I'm very, very excited to wear them, so yeah, love those so much. Next is something a little bit random. Now, I cannot remember the last time that I owned an umbrella, probably when I was about 15, which was like 10 years ago, which is ridiculous. Um, so I bought one, and this is pink and plastic. It's got a little pink end as well, it's polka dot. This umbrella is huge. I'm not gonna show you because I don't like putting umbrellas up inside houses because it's meant to be unlucky, and I'm superstitious, okay? Um, <laughs> this cost four pounds, which for a massive umbrella, I just think is an absolute bargain. Seriously, Primark is just full of cheap bargain things and I love it. So yeah, really excited for the rain, which is like really weird to say because I know most of you guys love summer, but I'm a massive autumn and winter person and I like the rain, so just embrace embrace the weather. That's what I'm gonna do. Next is a hat, which I instantly thought of Zoella when I saw it because it's got little bugs on it. It's got little pugs and it says on here, snug, as a pug, which I was just like, oh, it's so cute. Um, I'm not sure if I suit beanies, but I know that they're warm and that's the whole point of a hat. So yeah, four pounds for this snug pug hat and I just think it's really, really cute and oh, it's so adorable. Moving on to hair accessories, and I bought this, which was £1.50, which is just a simple blue wrap around headband. Um, I bought this because I thought it would go really nicely for like a pin up makeup tutorial, which I might do in the very near future, but I just thought it was really, really cute, and I love the sort of pin up style. So I bought that, and I also bought a second headband, and this is also £1.50. Now this one's a little bit different because it does have wire inserts so that you can bend it and it'll keep its shape. And I got this because one of my favorite shirts that I bought this month is the same pattern and I thought that this would go with it perfectly. So I'm really looking forward to wearing this. I just think it's really cute. Getting into that autumn, winter, Christmas spirit, it's candle season. Yep, I found two candles which I fell absolutely in love with in Primark. I'm gonna start off with this one. And this one is called Falling Star. These, both of these candles burn up to 40 hours and they were four pound each. So that's like one pound per 10 hours of burning time, which is ridiculous. Um, this one has a little star around it and it's just a chrome color. And it's such a pretty scent. I can't put my finger on it of what it actually smells like. But my favorite one out of the two is this one, which is Frosted Snowflake. And it has a little snowflake charm on the front. And this one's more warm. It's kind of like fresh linen and snowflakes. If you know what a snowflake smells like, 
this is what it smells like. So yeah, I also really like this because it's turquoisey duck egg colour. So yeah, candles, I'm also saving those for Christmas. Next in the bag of joy was actually some false nails. Now I've not actually bought false nails from Primark before, but I really, really liked the pattern on these. On this one, there are pink baby flamingos, which I just absolutely fell in love with. And these ones I bought for Halloween because they have little cute spoopy ghosties on them and I just couldn't resist. Sorry about the loud car outside, people are rude. Next is something that you're perhaps not going to be that excited about, I'm afraid, but these were one pound, and I have bought these before, but I threw them away. Um, these are some clear containers for liquids, and I'm going to Florida and Los Angeles in December, so these are going to be really, really useful. They are definitely travel essentials if you're going anywhere, and this kit is just really useful. It has like a little cute funnel, and on the other side it's got some little labels so that you can tell what are in the containers because you won't be able to tell otherwise so yeah I really really like these they're gonna be super super useful and last but not least is this top that I'm wearing I absolutely love this it's just a plain gray sweater but the sleeves are really really smooth and they've got like this monochrome sort of butterfly pattern on and I'm not a big fan of butterflies or moths but I just thought it was really really nice and seriously it's so soft if you go to Primark give the sleeves of this a little stroke without looking weird because they feel really good. This was um, 10 pounds and I don't have many of these sweaters where you're sort of transitioning from summer to autumn and winter so you don't wanna be too hot but you don't wanna be too cold. So yeah, I've been really, really enjoying this and I just think it's super, I think it's kind of quirky and a bit chic. So yeah, I really like it. And that is the end of my Primark haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up because I did have to film this twice. I literally face palmed so hard if you are new here please do click that subscribe button because I make brand new videos here every single week thank you very much for watching I hope you have a really good weekend I will see you guys soon bye